What is Alzheimer's disease? Alzheimer's disease involves irreversible neuronal degeneration, and is the most common cause of dementia in middle-aged and aged people. Alzheimer's disease accounts for 55% of cases of dementia, with the remainder accounted for vascular dementia, dementia with Lewy bodies, frontotemporal dementia and others. Alzheimer's disease has common symptoms that include dementia, memory loss, decline in speech, and confusion. For example, the patients may forget themselves or their relatives. They also do not know the simple things, such as fruits, vegetables and so on. When they get serious, they even do not know how to express themselves and write the words. But what caused the Alzheimer's disease? There are numerous hypotheses regarding Alzheimer's disease's pathogenesis including formation and metabolic disorders of amyloid beta, cholinergic hypothesis, abnormal tau protein phosphorylation, the metal ions hypothesis, the involvement of oxidative stress, and others. Thus the specific mechanism causing the Alzheimer's disease is still not understood. Pathologically, Alzheimer's disease is characterized by three hallmark elements. Numerous senile plaques composed of amyloid beta peptides. Abundant neurofibrillary tangles formed by filaments of highly phosphorylated tau proteins, and apparent loss of neurons in the brain. So what is amyloid hypothesis? This is related to amyloid beta. The amyloid beta is generated by sequential proteolytic cleavage of the transmembrane amyloid precursor protein by two membrane-bound enzymes, beta dash and gamma secretus. Beta secretus, a transmembrane aspartic protease known as base 1 or ASP2, cleaves at the N-terminal end of the amyloid beta region releasing the soluble sub beta, and, this is followed by gamma secretus cleavage of the membrane-bound C-terminal fragment to release amyloid beta. This is the amyloidogenic pathway. The non-amyloidogenic pathway results from alpha secretus cleavage the amyloid precursor protein. Amyloid beta is a neurotoxic and highly aggregatory hydrophobic peptide. The 42 residue form of the peptide is more prone to aggregation than the shorter and less hydrophobic 40 residue form. Senile plaques are the result of the extracellular accumulation of insoluble aggregates of amyloid beta protein. The amyloid hypothesis states that long-term deposition of amyloid beta peptide is responsible for toxic amyloid plaque formation and causes the onset and progression of the Alzheimer's disease. Tau hypothesis is another reason for Alzheimer's disease. Tau is a protein expressed in neurons that normally functions in the stabilization of microtubules in the cell cytoskeleton. Neurofibrillary tangles occur intracellularly and are composed of paired helical filaments of hyperphosphorylated tau protein. These tangles then aberrantly interact with cellular proteins, preventing them from executing their normal functions. Hyperphosphorylation occurs downstream of amyloid beta. 
with research suggesting that accumulation of amyloid beta may initiate this process. Additionally, there is evidence that toxic tau can enhance amyloid beta production via a feedback loop mechanism. Cholinergic hypothesis is the oldest statement. It proposes that Alzheimer's disease is caused by a reduction in acetylcholine. Acetylcholine is a molecule used in signaling between neurons. Besides, it plays a key role in learning and memory. When a nerve impulse reaches the presynaptic nerve terminal, it stimulates the release of the neurotransmitter, acetylcholine, into the cholinergic synapse. Acetylcholine diffuses across the synapse to the postsynaptic nerve terminal, and binds to receptors embedded in the membrane of the postsynaptic nerve terminal. The binding of acetylcholine to receptors in the postsynaptic neuron reinitiates the nerve impulse. Finally acetylcholine esterase, anchored to the membrane of the postsynaptic nerve terminal, hydrolyzes acetylcholine to acetate and choline resulting in the termination of the nerve impulse at the synapse. So according to the description, there are several important targets under research about Alzheimer's disease. They are beta secretus, gamma secretus, tau, amyloid beta and microtubule slash tubulin. Bach Sciences has directed sincere efforts toward providing customers with high quality small molecule reagents for Alzheimer's disease research.